Now, your exclusive Storm Team forecast from KTVO. Expect more. Hey, and a good Monday morning to you. Heartland Troy Mullen here from the Storm Team 3 Weather Center. Hope you're having a good start to the week. We're going to make it a good one. It is the coolest day that we... Today will be the coolest day that we've seen in the last several days. Temperatures will continue to rise and the melting will continue into later portions of the week and more single-digit temperatures in the future. It is definitely a possibility. We'll talk all about it in the extended forecast, but a few clouds moving through the area uh, overnight tonight. Those are hanging around. Also, a little bit of activity that moved on through, but looking to be just uh, of the drizzle variety, not getting really any reports of any issues with any of that. So currently right now, we're just really cloudy out there. Temperatures into the low 30s, uh, some upper 20s toward the east, 30 in Ottumwa, 32 in Kirksville, 33 in Macon, 26 currently in Mount Pleasant. The cloud cover really hum helping to keep the temperatures pretty steady across the region. Let's talk all about the clouds. A big portion of the eastern United States is impacted by this cloud cover. As, the, uh, cl as we get into the day, the temperatures will stay into the 30s and we'll have that slow clearing of the cloudy sky. So that will really help to keep the temperatures pretty moderated today over the next several hours. Check this out. Really not rising too much over the course of the day. Really around that uh, upper 20, low 30 degree mark throughout the remainder of the day with some cloudy skies and we'll have some slow clearing later on this afternoon. So we're staying below normal today. But as we get into the day tomorrow, look at, look at that. We're right above our normal of 36 for this time of year on Wednesday, right around average. And then uh, Wednesday night leading into Thursday, that's when we're going to have a big blast of colder air moving into the area. And that will knock our temperatures down very, very low, the coldest that we have seen in several days. But for today, let's give it a high of 33 degrees. There's the partly sunny to mostly cloudy skies, winds from the north at 5 to 10 miles per hour. And we'll have a, a, a few periods of sunshine later on this afternoon, but for the most part, looking to be cloudy skies. 21 tonight, which is above normal. The winds will start to turn from the south and southeast at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. And those clouds will linger with some partly cloudy skies for the next several days into the 40s on Tuesday. We'll give it a high of 40 degrees. 36 with partly sunny skies for Wednesday. And pay attention to Wednesday night. There's the blast of cold air moving in. Temperatures into the single digits. Only 19 for the high on Thursday. So feeling like winter with temperatures well below normal. Back closer to normal for Friday. 34 degrees. And our overnight lows for the week after being in the 20s and 30s early on will cool on down to the single digits and barely into the double digits for later on this week. We'll be right back after this.